Hi there guys, it's Halsey from Slim and Stylish and I'm a UK Stamping Up independent demonstrator and I am here with a new catalogue today. So this catalogue isn't to order from till June, but you can get your hands on it from May. If you want it, leave me a comment, go over to my Facebook post, leave me a comment there, or you can get me on my website or my email. All of my details are at the bottom of this post. And I will get one sent out to you in May free of charge, so let me know. But I'm gonna be doing a quick run through today of either items that I got on stage or that I've bought in the purchase premiere, just to give you a, a heads up and a bit of hints and tips of what's coming up in the catalog. So when you get to on stage, they first of all give you a bag with a free goodie in. Here was mine, Animal Outing. I love this set. I have a friend who is pregnant, so I think this little one here and this one is just gorgeous. I really like this set, and especially as that's going to be fantastic with the blends. You know me in colouring. It's a clear mount set, and that is now one of my new favourites. During on stage, you also get a prize patrol, so you have a badge with a number on. I was the number three. Um, I can't pass it you, it's hanging around a vase, I'll knock everything down. But I was a number three, and my prize patrol was this one, which is in every season, which has got 12 gorgeous flowers on it. Everyone was suggesting that these are for different months, and which ones do you use for each month? I know this one's the Christmas flower, isn't it? So that's December, but I... <laughs> I'm not sure about the others. To me, that one's April. I know it's a rose, but my grandma's name is Rose and her birthday is in April, so that's for her. But Easter's also in April, so you might think the daffodil. I just think they're gorgeous flowers. So that's the In Every Season set, and that's also a clear mount set. The final set that we were given at on stage is the Pick a Pennant set, which is a photopolymer set. And it's got the bunting at the top, but what's really nice is you've got the patterns to pop into the bunting and you've also got the words, sorry, the letters and the numbers. So you can put them on, you can put your little tie at the end, you can sit a little bird on top of them. Really universal set and they did a great presentation with this on stage, which was lovely and I can't wait to make up. Okay, let's run through my product purchase premiere then for you. Firstly is the Sitting Pretty set. I was a little bit unsure about this, um, actually I'm lying, this was gifted to me. It was gifted to me by Hannah, she's Stamping with Hannah, um, and I do blog post with her on a Thursday so you can find her blog off that. She's gifted me this stamp set um, because I fell in love with it on stage. I was in a bit mixed feelings but this dog has sold it for me, it is gorgeous. And the person who demonstrated it on stage put the two dogs together and did the masking effect loved it it was amazing thought that was brilliant and um hannah very nicely was listening to me going on and on about it and she's given it to me it's photopolymer set and this dog is going to be used on everything i pre-warn you definitely love it okay next i'm trying to unpack this in order but i know i'll i'll fail is the painted glass suite i can't remember what it was called but there's the stamp set oh i think it was a clear mount set it is a clear mount set you can tell been in it already and you've got the thin lit dies to go with it now the reason why i love this set and this really sells it to you is the vellum instead of having a dsp with this set it is this gorgeous vellum I'll see if I hold it up to the light, see through. But how great are these going to be with the blends? I think they are gorgeous. I'll show you my favourite. It will surprise you, I think, because normally I'm a flower girl. So I can imagine that you all think I would like that one with all the flowers on. But I don't. Well, I do. That's nice. But that's my favourite with the birds. <laughs> That's why I got it. And what would be great to do with this is to get your blends out, turn it the other way, colour on the outside, and it will look still frosted on the other side as a frosted glass is in church. So there we go. I love this set. With that, you can put so much colour with this, which is great with the new ink colours, which I will get to and I will show you. The thinlets remember how many there was but there was one for each of these and there was also a half one for the top in fact 
let me just open this and show you that would be so much quicker than me explaining it I said this was going to be a quick flash through video it's obviously going to be a bit longer but I want you to get a sense of what you might be buying before you buy it so there you go there's the dies to go with it so you've got them to go round the, the little bits you've got the fan the top window a middle window the square and you've got a little square so you can make your own door or window up with that love it and finally to go with that Tinted faceted buttons. <laughs> That's a long winded, isn't it? But they're these. How gorgeous are those? They're I'm looking at my actual screen and they don't look on there as good as that. They're glass, so they're kind of transparent. You can see through them. In a, the pink, the green, and this sort of ambery colour. And they're gorgeous. They really are ever so nice. All in different sizes and their buttons with the holes in so that you can attach them to your card. So they will actually look like the crushed glass that you get in the windows. Love that. And there was a ribbon for this suite as well. Let me see if I can just grab that out. I haven't changed the order of my box round yet so that it runs in suites. So whatever I pick up next is going to be a, as much a surprise to me as it is to you. So this is the ribbon. It's not really a ribbon, it's more of a cord. I don't know whether that, that and it's shiny, but it's a very it's more of a plastic actually. It's really nice. And they've called it they've called it cord cord. Um but it's quite nice. I was playing with it when we were on stage and I thought I prefer the feel of that. And because it is quite plasticky and it is quite a, a strong ribbon. Or cord uh, it ties really nice so I was quite impressed with that okay so I think that's that for that suite but if there's anything else when I dive in my box I will let you know so next up is oh I got the tailored tag punch um, I didn't already have it from the occasions catalog so that's in my box but that's not not new Aha, uh -huh, here we go. What you've all been waiting for. Call me Clover. Pineapple punch. Lovely lipstick. Blueberry bushel. And grapefruit grove. How gorgeous are the new ink colours. And these are the new stamping pads. I played with them on stage and I think they're better. I know everybody will have their own opinion. But I like them. I'll show you why. Normally, with the old stamp pads, you were having to push them up and pull them open, and it could be quite, quite messy. These, uh, come on, Helen, do it right. Oh no! Yes, there we go. You just push them up with your finger. I'm still trying to do. It's so natural just to go like that now, but instead you push, pull up, like you would a compact. And then you still push back like you used to, but when you're finished, you just close like that. There is no more getting your fingers stuck in the ink, which is great. Also, you've got these little bobbly bits, so they stand on top of each other. Whereas before, I don't know about you, but whenever I did classes, trying to stand these on top, they're wobbly and they fall all over the place. What is also great about these, which at the time when she first said it, I didn't register, but I got it afterwards, are these stickers under here. Not only have you got one for the front of your case, but there is a new bit on your stamp set that lets you put it there. So that when all of your stamps are open and you don't know which colour is which, you will know. So I like those and I love the new ink colours. We had a discussion on our table. A lot of people love the lovely lipstick. And Grapefruit Grove seemed to also be quite popular on stage, but mine was Blueberry Bushel. I like Night of Navy, but it's just a bit too dark. This I'm going to be using an awful lot. So they're the new ink colours. Welcome to them. Quite happy by that. Right, what else have I got? This is a new stamp set called Enjoy Life. 
Um, the reason I got this set was because of these down here. There was examples where people had done these as a silhouette on the grass and they put bright colours behind it and it looked amazing. So they'd done it more of a shadow stamp and that was really cool. Can't wait to play with that. And then this one here. When you arise in the morning, think of what a precious privilege it is to be alive, to breathe, to think, to enjoy, to love. Just love it. And most importantly, wake up, kick butt and repeat. I think that's my, my little saying. So that's why I picked that one up. Um, what else have I got in here? The Detailed with Love stamp set. This is so cute. We played with this while we were there and we had someone demonstrate this. It comes with some paper that I haven't purchased so I can't show it you. Um, but it's really pretty paper. I do actually have some in my pack from on stage. Um, it's like a doily, it's a netting. Very pretty with all the patterns on that you can use. But I liked the font. Life is sweet with friends like you. And I like this because I've just bought the layering ovals. So I thought it would go quite well together, really. It comes in its section with um, some ribbon. So the ribbon that's with this one is the polka dot ribbon. Which is this one here. Just open it. Find the end somewhere. There it is. It's a bit awkward having a, a sparkly netting with a sellotape. So that's the polka dot ribbon. It's quite nice. There is also a punch that comes with this. I haven't got it, so I won't tell you. But yeah, there is. Um, next up is some cardstock. So obviously the new in colour packs with all the different in colour cards in. So that's quite nice. That'll go with my ink. And finally, I think this is finally. Oh no, it's not. I've got this as well. Hand delivered, which is going to be one of the host sets. And I love this because it's got her bottom just there. Her skirt and her legs. And you can put the patterns in. But the balloon, you can see a little arms and blouse, covers where her head would be. Or she's got the cakes or the books or anything else, or is she going to be holding the sign? So I thought this was a really cute photopolymer set, and it's great being photopolymer because you'll be able to line it all up perfectly, especially with the Stamparatus. <laughs> Has everyone got their Stamparatus yet? Are you enjoying them? What, what's your thoughts on the Stamparatus? You'll have to let me know. Right, the next part is a bundle. So in the bundle, it's called the Share What You Live Suite. You get the cardstock that goes with it. So it's including some of the new colours. The very vanilla cardstock. You get a ribbon. You get a embossing folder. You get some pearls. You get the Share What You Love Embellishment Suite. You get some doilies. You get... DSP and you get not one, not two, but three stamp sets. So let me run you through this and show you. Oh, and you get some envelopes as well. Oh, and and I did forget the call me the grapefruit grove new ink colour that came in this bundle. So this was all together, and you can pick this up as a starter kit. So if you wanted all of this, you can get it now as a starter kit. How great is that? So let me run through it all quickly with you. The ribbon, I'll show you the ribbon. You can see the break in it, that's why I haven't gone for my scissors, but I really should have gone for my scissors. Give up. It's as it is, it is. I'm too impatient to play with the packaging. It's this gorgeous velvet ribbon really nice love a bit of velvet you've obviously got the ink pad I've introduced you to the ink pad already the stamp sets is love what you do which is this one this font is very similar to a stamp set we have at the moment so I like that good coordination this stamp set here is the make a difference stamp set it's photopolymer so you can link all of the letters together to make your words for anyone in Wales, you do have some of the Welsh 
ones, the double L's that will help with what you're writing. But again, you've got the ths. And down here, the s and ds and ths for the end of your, your letter part, your number part, which is great. But I like the bottom, hashtag send a card, handcrafted just for you, but it's got your www dot and your dot com. So if you're starting to think of making this as a business and haven't got your own personalised stamps yet, this could totally put your website on the back of your cards. Think about that one. Oh, and it's a Stampin' Up one. So I don't know whether you know with a Stampin' Up Angel policy, if you're making any Stampin' Up cards and sending them, they should really be having the uh, uh, the copyright Stampin' Up somewhere on the card. And that's there, and it's only tiny. Um, and it's in this set, just there, so that you can pop it on the back of your card. So that covers that as well got to get compliant the statement of my heart stamp said you can't purchase this this is not going to be in the catalog this is just in this bundle so you need to get this bundle when it comes available to customers this bundle will be available in may and you can pick this up but if you don't get this stamp set you won't get it because it's not for sale in the catalogue and it has the stamping up statement of the heart um, which is what all the demonstrators sort of agree to do so I like that set it's a cute set talking of the statement of the heart it is on the embellishment box so let me open this and show you what's inside it it is a go gorgeous little box you can't have enough embellishment boxes can you I don't think so you should see there's a shelf to the side of my desk on this side and it's piled high with pretty boxes and tins and bits and pieces. So in here you've got, oh, you've got some cute little paper clips. Oh, look at those. Can you, can you see those in the bag? Those little roses? Gorgeous. They're in there and they, they're stuck on the back. So you pull the back off and they'll stick on automatically. You don't have to worry about your adhesives. You've got your twine. And there you've got your, your whisper white thread. And then you've got some pretty tags in there as well. So that's quite cute. I like that. That might be one of my hostess gifts. Quite sweet. But I do like the box, so it might not be. It might just be for me. <laughs> okay. We've seen envelopes before. They're the, the vanilla, very vanilla, to go with the cardstock. And I'll move that cardstock pack as well. You, you, you've seen cardstock, you know what it's about. These doilies are pearlized doilies. So what they've tried to do this year is they've put quite a lot of pearlized stuff into this suite because stamping up a turning 30, 30 is supposed to be pearl. So on the one side it's really shimmery and on the other side it's just plain whisper white. But they're gorgeous and I haven't tried because obviously I've only just got this. But Sophie, one of our French demonstrators, said that these are gorgeous when coloured with your blends. But they're quite thick, so they could handle being brayed or spritzed as well. Quite like those. And you get, what does it say how many you get? You get 24 in there. Again, you get pearls in different pretty colours. All will coordinate with the paper as well. One of the textured dies so that's I was, I was going to open it to show you but um there's no point it's got a picture on the front it's the textured impression ones as well so it will look even thicker and fuller and it's lovely floral and that goes with this set because it matches with the paper and let me show you the paper finally this is a big set of paper this is there is lots in it but it's all gorgeous and guess what it's all pearlized there was a few packs of paper that we could have in the product purchase for demonstrators. Um, this was this and the vellum was what I chose to got to get. There's so many sheets of this; it's going to keep you going for a bit, to be honest. So you've got this. There's one, two, three, four of each pattern. And it's twelve by twelve, so that's your first one. And then your second. For those of you who've been a customer of Stampin' Up! for some time, you'll notice this is using the returning colours quite excitingly. And on the back there, we worked this out earlier, these are names of flowers. So you've got um, Dalphinium there, um, 
the chrysanthemum carnation oh that one says maritima but i thought it said martini <laughs> i got quite excited i like the martini not that I, i'm a drinker but i do, I do like the martini here we go some more pearlized ones and on the back there flowers you know what that'll look good with the happy birthday gorgeous stamp set because that has leaves in like this doesn't it so that's really nice another pearlized one i like this color I do like this color oh and i love that isn't that happy i like that one that's fun and this is beautiful anything with a bit of pink in there is good for me and there are the flowers and those are really good because they are very much like the flowers that are on here so you can coordinate all of this together and what's nice as well I don't know if you've noticed with what I'm showing you but what is on the back is matches what's on the front so if you're a bag person or a box person you can bend this backwards and have both of the patterns going together which is nice they're very full flowers again they're pinkish though quite happy with that and that's the back and you get four of each so that's a lovely pack um, on top of that there was one more thing at the bottom of my box hiding and this was with the painted glass suite and it's the faceted dots so I'm glad these are back because I loved the, um, the little diamantes the black rhinestones we had at Christmas so it's very much like those by the way if you haven't seen they are on the UK clearance rack at the moment and they are about two quid something like that so if you wanted the black ones from Christmas get on there but if not they're going to have them in the new catalogue and they're here and they're faceted so they sparkle even more everybody thanks for joining me I hope you enjoyed it if you do want a catalogue let me know any questions let me know and these will be the new products you see in my new videos coming up thanks for joining me have a good evening bye